Hi DIYers, Sterling with Alarm Grid here. And today we're gonna to show you how to delete a key fob from your Honeywell Lyric system. So key fobs uh, such as the 5834-4 um, or the new Lyric key fob as well is gonna be supported by this system. So any of the 5800 series key fobs and the new Lyric key fob are, are all supported by this system. And uh, no matter what key, fab you key fob that you have, uh, key fobs are a great way to one touch arm or disarm the system. So put them on your keychains, they're very handy. You can arm, disarm to away or stay uh, with the touch of a button and not need to know a code. They're good for handing out to um, friends or neighbors that may need temporary access to the house without giving away your secure user codes. You can even set it up to set off a panic button from the fob so that if you're approaching the home and someone attacks you or have any reason to sound the alarm in the house and because you hear things outside the house that are suspicious, you can press a button on the fob to set off a panic. So a whole host of reasons that you would use the fob and a really nice security addition to your system uh, for convenience sake. However, uh, by making it convenient, it's also a potential security risk and it's important to understand that. If someone got a hold of your keys, okay, they now have a key to your door. Uh, they can unlock your door and come in. And if this is on your keychain, they now have a device. Without knowing your code, they'll be able to disarm your system, unlock your lock, and have full access to your house. So it's very, very important that you know where this is at all times. And if you were to lose it, that you know that it's very easy to delete the key fob from the system so that if someone did get a hold of this fob, as long as you've deleted it, they can't come and disarm the system with the touch of a button. So we hope you never lose your fob, and if you do, uh, we want you to know that there is a way to keep the security. And then that way, if you're thinking you didn't want to use a fob because you were worried about that kind of risk, maybe uh, you'd be able to use the convenience features and still account for the security issues. So. To delete a fob, it's very simple. We go into programming by hitting tools in 4112, which is the default installer code. We're going to zip past this AlarmNet 360 prompt. This is a prompt you'll see only if your system has not yet been enabled for monitoring. You just say no if you're not monitored. We hit program and keys. And you can see we only have one key fob program so far. It is this 5834-4 that we just programmed in a prior video. And to delete it, can't get much easier. Highlight it so it's blue. Click delete. And yes, you're sure. Now no items to display. If we know a criminal or somebody got a hold of our fob, because the fob's been deleted from the system programming, when we come back to the home screen, this device that previously was arming and disarming our system is not doing anything at all. It's still in the high security mode, but because it's been deleted from the programming, there's no way that someone would be able to break in with, or to disarm the system and gain access to the property without you uh, knowing about it. And that deletion can be done locally. If you know you lost it, you get home and do it. Or if you're monitored and you're not home, and you want to get that thing deleted as soon as you lose your key fob or as soon as you know that you've lost your key fob, your monitoring provider should have the ability to delete that remotely on a 5834-4 sensor. So um, we hope you've enjoyed that video on how to delete a key fob from your Honeywell Lyric security system. If you have any questions on deleting your fobs from your system, please let us know, support at alarmgrid.com. And make sure to subscribe to our channel so you're kept up to date on all of the videos that we'll be releasing about all of the great features on this new Honeywell Lyric security system.